Welcome back. A nice soaking rain across the Twin Tiers last night. Anywhere between a half an inch and an inch of rain fell across the viewing area. A cold front now off to our south and east and not much showing up on radar right now. And there will be a sprinkle or a brief shower in a few spots this evening, but not enough to cancel your outdoor plans. Uh, similar conditions are expected for our Wednesday. Uh, as we're dealing with an upper level low pressure system over southern Canada. So our weather story for tonight, we are calling for the threat for a sprinkle or a light passing shower tonight and tomorrow. Temperatures a bit below average for this time of year, but sunshine returns on Thursday. Temperatures by then into the upper 70s and then 80s in the forecast. Mid 80s is what we're forecasting right now for Friday. Uh, but with the chance for a late day shower or thunderstorm as our next cold front heads our way. Right now in Hornby at 73, 76 in Bath, 78 in the Glen, 75 in Spencer, Tawanda at 75 degrees as well, and Wellsboro at 74. We do have a cold front off to the south and east. Now it's this cold front that passed through our area uh, overnight last night and gave us the beneficial rain. Still dealing with an upper level low though here over southern Canada. And with this kind of pinwheeling around, this area uh, will be dealing with some spotty showers coming in on the northwesterly flow, but uh, this moisture is very light compared to what's associated with the cold front. So any additional rainfall tonight or tomorrow will be very light and spotty in nature. In fact, uh, the latest radar showing hardly anything uh, back to the north and west and uh, may be dodging a couple sprinkles tonight, but nothing more than that. 78 currently in Elmira, some limited sunshine in a few spots at this hour. 71 in Bradford, 77 in Rochester, Harrisburg, one of the warmer spots right now at 85 degrees. So 24 hour planner, a few sprinkles this evening, lingering clouds overnight down near 60 and tomorrow a brief shower. Also a possibility, certainly not a washout. 74 though, the best we can do for our five degree guarantee. So temperatures below average, but we'll work on those readings here by the end of the week. We'll actually end up above average temperature wise. Wednesday at 10 o'clock in the morning. Again, a few sprinkles here and there. Otherwise, variably cloudy skies. We will have some peaks of sunshine, uh, partly cloudy skies for tomorrow night. And then Thursday looking much nicer with high pressure sliding east out of the Ohio Valley. A lot of sunshine. Temperatures closer to where we should be for this time of year with highs in the upper 70s. Comfortable humidity levels and then we'll really boost those temperatures up by Friday. Tioga Fair ongoing in Whitneyville, Pennsylvania between Wellsboro and Mansfield. Here's your fair forecast Wednesday and Thursday and Friday looking pretty good. Maybe a spotty shower tomorrow. Now the fireworks have been rescheduled to tomorrow evening at dusk uh, in the uh, tractor pull intermission. And then we're looking at dry conditions Thursday and Friday, a late day thunderstorm, but temperatures then into the 80s. For today, we forecast the highest 76. We've topped out at 78. Right around 60 tonight, a few spots in the upper 50s, 74 for tomorrow's five degree guarantee. And our first warning 70 forecast does show a couple thunderstorms Friday and Saturday, but again, it's not going to be a washout and temperatures will be on the warm side. And then check out next week as we go into actually late this weekend and early next week, temperatures well up into the 80s, so above average by then. Maybe a thunderstorm sneaking back in late in the day on Tuesday. Heating up. I know it's almost fall. Okay, it's, September's almost here, but I think we'll still got a few hot days in us. We do, and keep telling yourself that tomorrow when you have a light jacket on because temperatures are going to be a little cool, but you'll know that warmer temperatures not that far off. Perfect. Thank you, Joe. Mm -hmm.